Today we're going to do a quick comparison on the Dokio versus the EcoWorthy. They're both 100 watt portable solar panel systems. The uh, EcoWorthy I had just got not too long ago and it's a pretty rugged setup. Uh, <clears throat> the other system, the Dokio, it's a little bit more uh, flexible. You got to be much more careful with it. Uh, they both fold up and I'll show you that a little bit later on. Uh, the EcoWorthy, like I said, 100 watt, 12 volt. Dokio, 100 watt, 12 volt. And we are doing this in the middle of winter right now here up northeast. So we're getting some halfway decent sun. Uh, it's a little past uh, probably one o'clock. So we're not getting the immediate noontime sun. But I set these up so they were basically about the same uh, angle and same spot in the sun. And we're going to do a quick comparison to see what you're pulling out of these. This happens to be a uh, LA Joy. They make them by all kinds of different names. You can find them on uh, Amazon or wherever. And this happens to be the 800 watt unit. Now, this basically all it is is a solar multimeter. Excuse me, multimeter. And... They will connect via different adapters. It comes with this adapter here, and it also comes with alligator clips. And I'll do a little more, more in-depth review on this unit uh, probably when I test out all my other 24-volt solar panels. So you're gonna see that I do, on this particular panel, I have these changed from the negative and positive on the terminals because the way the adapter had connected it you either need to use one of these uh, adapters which will actually change the polarity of uh, negative and positive or in this case with the unit with the uh, multimeter you can just go ahead and change the cables off onto the different jacks and because this does not work on any kind of batteries it only powers up once you've got power coming from the solar panels now, as you can see, we are running this right now on auto mode, so it will do a constant check of the uh, wattage and voltage and everything coming in from that panel. And it's running probably only about 45 watts, pretty much on average right now. And if you can see the screen. Now, it also has a backlight feature, which will help improve the view on this, but even without, the backlight feature running you can still see it pretty good uh, you can see it better probably off camera so like I said now we're up to about 47 so this is probably getting about 47 to maybe at max 50 watts of power generated from these uh, that solar panel I'm gonna switch this off to the eco worthy I'm gonna test that real quick Okay, with the EcoWorthy, you can see I have swapped the uh, cables back to the correct jacks because uh, the polarity is correct on that. Now, you're going to see with this particular one, EcoWorthy, running auto, it instantly went up to about 52 uh, watts of solar. So, it, it really isn't a huge difference, and again, it could be a slight difference on based on how much sun they are getting at the angles uh, because this eco worthy is a much stiffer unit and stays in place the, the other one flexes as I mentioned earlier and it may not get the direct sun as good as this one does so they're both putting out pretty, you know, approximately the same wattage uh, however my choice out of these two units absolutely is that eco worthy uh, I bought this on Amazon probably for I think at the time they were selling it for like 90 bucks uh, this one I think when they were selling these I paid about hundred and twenty five for it and as you can see you know decent little carry case not bad uh, very very flexible and being how I know I am on my gear I prefer this one right here that is much much uh, uh, more rigid and 
it's a little smaller takes up a little bit less space and it has your uh, ability to with these stands on each side so you can actually take these little pins and angle them however you want to in order to angle this up it's all built into the unit so again if i were going to buy these again i would definitely go with the eco worthy over the dokio so uh thanks for watching and uh have a great day